I'm at Hackworth Park in Shildon, so we're going to use some of the uh, Parkletic equipment. So before we get started, we just want to make sure we're COVID safe, uh, COVID secure. So I've got my wipes, I've given everything a wipe um, when I got here this morning. I've also got some hand gel, so hand sanitizer and water. Really important to stay hydrated throughout exercise before and after and throughout the day. Um, so I've already walked down here, so I'm already quite warmed up, but we'll do a little bit of a warm up and uh, we'll start with mobilizing our joints first. So we'll start with our ankles. So just small little rotations and then gently rocking side to side. So we swap it over opposite side, rotating our ankle, gently rocking it side to side. So we're moving up to our hip flexors out across and down out across and down that's it so opening our hip flexors so one more on each side so we take our hands on our hips big hip circles to the center change in direction so let's make this one even bigger all the way around change direction arm circles going forwards and backwards, so big circles. Take it across your chest. So opening your chest up, hands together, rotating our wrists. And then just shaking everything out and taking it into a nice match. So getting our knees nice and high, chest stays up, big arms. So we're gonna slowly take it wider to a half squat so head and chest stay up hips and bottom go back that's it halfway so we'll do two more that's it one more back to matching on the spot again knees up nice and high take it wider let's try and drop it down to a deeper spot again warming our legs up head and chest stay up hips and bottom go back so two more and this time if you can heels to bum so jogging on this spot again if you want to you can just march on this spot still warming up Slowly bring it to a stop. So half star jumps to the side, to the center, to the side, to the center. So big arms. So one more on each side and well done. So we're gonna move the area and we're gonna start with doing some squats. Okay, so round one, first exercise, Squats. So you've got different level of squats, but with it still warming up, we're going to start with this level. So our head and chest stay up, hip and bottom go back, arms out, head and chest as we come up. So try and get your bottom to touch on each rep. So again, if you've got a stopwatch, you can pop it on for 30 seconds per exercise. So we'll do two more, one more, brilliant. Okay, so next exercise, we're gonna take it round to the back of the steps. So option one, you've just got your toe taps. Option two, we're stepping on, stepping off. So hands on our hips, we step on with our right leg, we take it down with our right leg, swap it over, lead with the left, down with the left. Keep alternating. Again, head and chest stay up. One more on each leg. Brilliant, next exercise. So we're gonna challenge ourselves, jogging up, walking back down. So off we go. If you find the jog up too much, you can just do a power walk up. Walk back down. So 
where we're just picking a level that suits us best. Okay, next exercise. So we've got the mountain climbers. Again, we've got different levels. To start off with, we're gonna use a higher box. Body nice and straight. Lifting our knee nice and high. Well done. Next, we take it to core. Okay. Palms down. Weight of our heels is pushed forward. So we hold it here. If that's too much, you can drop it down onto your knees. Or you can pop it back up onto your toes. Brilliant. Next exercise, so we want to take it round onto our back. Arms up, legs at that right angle. So dead beetle. So opposite our leg, go back at the same time, pulling back into the centre, swapping it over. So we're trying not to let our back overarch, keeping our belly button pulled into our spine. recovery we bring our knees in up to sit in so again hydration key okay so the first round if you remember we started with squats you can keep with squats and you can take it down so you're going lower into your squat or if you want to add the intensity we can do a squat jump so we squat down power up Head and chest stay up. So explosive power. And well done. So step ups. So remember we started with that step up. So if it was too much, you can go to toe taps. You can keep it with the step up or you can add a knee lift or you can progress to the higher one. So we step up, knee up. Swap it over, opposite knee. One more on each leg. Well done. So treadmills. We started on the higher box. You can stay on the higher box or you can drop it down. So knees are nice and high. Well done. So remember the next one, we walk to the top, we jog down. You can walk up, walk down, walk up, jog down, or run up, run down. It's your choice. Okay, we take it over to core. So we started with the low plank. You can do that again, drop it on your knees, bring it up. This time we're gonna do the high plank. Three, two, one, up. down. So we're going to swap it over onto our back next. So 
remember last time we did dead beetle, this time if you want to, swap it over to an alternating crunch. Or you can stay with the first option. Round three, we're bringing it back down to like we did at the start. So we're slowly cooling down as well while exercising. So back to those squats. So bottom touches straight back up. Again, you can step it down if you want to challenge yourself. Drop it a little bit lower. That's it, head and chest stay up. So make sure we're touching before we come back up. Hips and bottom go down. So again, if you've got a timer, 30 seconds. Last one. Brilliant, well done. So we take it behind for those step ups. So again, we started with a single step up, then we progressed with the knee lift. We're gonna take it back down. So you can pick which box you wanna step on. So we lead with the right, we go down with the right. Lead with the left, go down with the left. So we keep alternating. one brilliant so we're going to take it to the moving exercise so we started walking jogging we progressed to jogging jogging so you can keep it walking jogging walking walking you pick your level that suits you so off we go Well done. Next we take it to the full body exercise. So we started with the treadmill to start off with. We started with a higher level. Then we dropped it down and we speeded it up. So this time bringing it back down to where we started. Body in a straight line, knees up. Wonderful. So you bring that to a stop. Over to core. Okay, we're going to start with that plank again. So low plank. You can drop it on your knees or you can stay on your toes. Just make sure your body's in a nice straight line. Pulling your belly button into your spine. onto your knees, taking it onto our back, swapping it over, still working core. Arms up, knees up, dead beetle. Opposite arm, opposite leg. So we're trying not to let our back arch, keeping our belly button pulled into our spine. And knees in, slowly up to sitting. So coming up onto our feet, well done, that's brilliant. So we're just gonna have a little walk around while we're cooling down.
Okay, so we'll do a few stretches just to finish off. So one leg forward, one leg back, front leg bent, we lean forward into that stretch. So we're just holding it there. Slowly come up, we take it back with the opposite leg. Again, we lean it forward slightly. Slowly come up, this time all the weight on the back leg. So front leg stays nice and straight, head and chest stay up, hold that stretch. We slowly come up, we swap it over. So we take it back with the opposite leg and that back leg, front leg stays nice and straight, head and chest stay up. And slowly come up, so right arm across our chest, looking in the opposite direction. Gently release, stretch in between, swap it over, again looking in the opposite direction. Gently release, stretch, hands in the lower back, hold that stretch. Again, head and chest stay up. So we reverse the movement, we take our arms forward, chin to chest, up high, big stretch, as you come down, rotating your wrists and give yourselves a big clap, well done.